hey guys welcome back to my channel guys in today's video i will be showing you how you can connect your android studio with your actual mobile phone so guys if you have installed android studio and you are trying to run your application on avd or emulator and if you don't have good enough ram then sometime it happens your application runs very slowly in that case you can connect your actual mobile phone and studio and you can run your application so guys i will be showing you all the steps one by one so do watch my video till end so guys let's start so guys first of all i will be showing you what settings you have to do on your mobile phone after that i will be showing you how you can connect your mobile phone and your android studio so let's dive into this so guys let's go to the settings of mobile phone so take your mobile phone and in that go to settings and in settings go to about section of your phone so guys actually what step i am showing you how to enable developer option unless you enable developer option you can't connect your mobile phone and your android studio under developer option we have to do certain settings okay so now after going to about section of your phone you have to go to software information i'm having vivo mobile you may have different mobile then this configuration may differ uh, you just check it out where is your build number okay so in my case my build number is under uh, software information so i'm just scrolling down here and guys here i'm having my build number so guys i will be tapping this build number several times so it will do what enable my developer option so you can see you are now in developer mode so now guys uh, let's search developer option and so here in search i'm just typing developer so you can see now this developer option it's showing and guys you can see it has been enabled okay how it has been enabled because we tap build number several time hence it is enabled so developer option is enabled now now let's move to the uh, searching of wireless debugging so here i will be searching wireless debugging so guys here let me just tell you you can connect your actual mobile phone to android studio by three ways one is using your usb cable another way is what through your wireless uh, debugging option so if you are doing uh, wireless debugging then again you have two option you can connect it through qr code or you can connect through some code okay so in this video i will be showing you how you can connect through qr code okay i will be creating separate video for how you can connect your android studio through code or through usb okay so now here i am searching uh, wireless debugging and here guys just scroll down and here you can see wireless debugging option is there but it is not enabled so i need to just enable it and then guys it's showing me some information so i need to just click on this allow so my wireless debugging option is enabled now now i need to go to this option so i will just click on this wireless wireless debugging option here under wireless debugging you can see we have two option uh, pair through qr code or connect through code okay so guys now i will be showing you settings of android studio so you have to go to device manager in your android studio and guys here you can see pair using wi-fi option we have and here also we have pair using wi-fi you can select any of this option so let me just quickly select this pair using wi-fi so guys here you can see it's showing me this screen pair new devices over wi-fi so i'm going to select the second tab that is pair using code and guys on my mobile phone it has already shown me one code so i need to enter this code in my android studio so actually my android studio is searching for a device once the searching will complete it will show me ip address of that my mobile device over here available uh, devices so now here you can see it's showing me available devices in my android studio now i will be clicking on this pair button to pair my mobile phone with this uh, android studio so guys now here i need to enter the code which was shown on my mobile phone so here quickly i'm entering that code i'm i'm clicking on this pair button and boom guys you can see my android studio has has been connected to my uh, this phone here you can see it's showing me vivo phone connected through 
uh, Wi-Fi and here also it's showing me message so that mean my connection is successful even you can see on mobile device also it's showing me my desktop name over here okay and in device manager also it's showing me my phone name and it's showing me physical phone is connected right and at the top also you can see it's showing me physical phone name so guys I'm clicking on this play button to run my application my application is very simple it is going to just print a hello world it's a normal application so guys it is building and installing my apk on my actual physical uh, mobile device so once it will complete you will see output on my mobile screen so let's wait for it okay guys so you can see here i'm getting hello world on my screen and here in android studio you can see the information it's showing that it has connected to vivo device okay so my device name it is showing so now i will just uh, search for my application name so you can see my application name is demo app uh, so what i'm doing i'm just uh, showing you that yes actually the apk has been installed so here i'm just searching demo app and here guys you can see it's showing me my application name that is demo app is this way we have connected our mobile devices to android studio now guys i will be showing you how you can remove this connection so uh, connection can be removed from your cell phone so you have to go to your uh, wireless debugging option and you can see the connection it's showing um, your pc name and now here uh, click on and you can select uh, what forget option so it will forget that uh, Wi-Fi and your connection is removed here you can see now in device manager my connection is removed so there is no option to remove this connection through Android studio you can forget through your mobile phone so uh, if you want to remove the connection you can follow this so that's all guys I conclude my video I hope you really enjoyed watching this video so guys if you really liked it please hit on like button and if you have have any query you can put in comment box i will surely reply to your queries and guys if you uh, like this video please share with your friends and if you are new to my channel please subscribe to my channel guys it takes lots of effort to create such kind of video i hope you understand that your subscription is very important for me so please subscribe to my channel and guys i'm sharing lots of pdf and resources on my telegram channel you can join my telegram channel also i'm there on uh, instagram also you can follow me there also all my social media link i have shared in description box you can follow and join through that thank you guys for watching my video i'll see you in my next video till that bye bye take care keep learning keep watching guys